Hi, today we are going to talk about commercial proxy. The institution itself constitutes a specific type of power of attorney that can be established only and exclusively by entrepreneur who is a subject to the obligation of registration to the Register of Entrepreneurs of National Court Register. Simply put, it can be said that every commercial proxy is a power of attorney. But not every power of attorney is a commercial proxy. To meet the expectations and needs of entrepreneurs, the legislature identified three types of commercial proxy – so, joint and branch. So, also referred to as independent, which makes it possible for a commercial proxy to act independently and freely on behalf of the principal. Joint, which is characterized by necessity of cooperation of the commercial proxies, and branch, which limits the scope of commercial proxies activity to the matters entered in the Register of Entrepreneurs branch. Activities undertaken on behalf of the principal are restricted to the scope of activities related strictly to conducting economic activity within the meaning of Article 551 of the Civil Code. Scope of activities cannot be limited as an unusual power of attorney. Each activity exceeding the specified sphere will be treated as exceeding the powers of a commercial proxy and might be invalid. Commercial proxy is a specific commercial authorization. Approval by all partners accompanied directors authorized to run the partnership or company's affairs is required to establish a commercial proxy. But a decision of one partner authorized to run the partnership affairs is required to revoke it. The appointment of a commercial proxy takes three steps – appointing a commercial proxy, acceptance of the commercial proxy position, and submission of the application form with appointment resolution to National Court Registry. It should be done within seven days from the date of appointment, even though appointment is valid since the date of resolution. And by the way, written form of the proxy appointment documents is required even though proxy will act on behalf of the company before the notary and has the right to sign a notary date.